Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are on episode 64 of the Completionist Crafter series. Today, as the last couple of episodes, this is a death school recipe only. I'm just going to state, state that right now. Um, but today we are crafting steel health from Mortis, obviously. Um, so yeah, on screen is everything that you will need and require um, in order to craft this really, probably not the two most useful treasure card, but you know. It's a treasure card nonetheless, and we have to craft it. Um, ignore everything that's loading in the background. I had to reinstall the game three times, so don't don't worry about it. It's all good. But yeah, here we go. Um, let's just go to treasure cards so we can do it. Steel health. Um, requires one ghoul treasure card, which you can either craft or you can um, buy in the bazaar or the libraries. Um, Onyx, I recommend going to probably the Crocotopia or Wizard City reagent vendor. Black Coal, same place. Or you can go to Celestia because... It's a bit more closer to the um, spiral door. Mistwood, um, best place. Um, Knight's Court or outside Knight's Court, that area there. Um, I have a Reagent Hunters video um, on it as well. And or best place is probably um, the Shadow Palace or Dragon Spire. Those two have a lot of it. Um, I just need to quickly sell a couple of treasure cards because we are full. As always, we forget that we cannot sell it with another window up because why, why would... You do that, you know. Fire trap, sure, we'll sell all of those. Five of them, sure thing. Sure thing, there we go, now we can craft it. Haha, -ha, wrong crafting station. One problem with having them all next to each other. Right, let's do this. Boom, professional. Four, oh, yeah, steel health, fantastic. So, um, that treasure card steals 350 life, or basically just destroys the minion to give to yourself. So I use this for my um, Elixir Vitae badge, but you can also use it for one in a million and Elixir Vitae to get them at the same time. Um, really useful thing there, you just trap them in and, and blade and then boom, destroy it. So yeah, that's fun. But otherwise, not a particularly useful card, mainly because you don't really use minions, but if you need to, that's a good option there. Um, to get some health back if you have a minion out. But anyway, thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.